Hey, what's going on, guys? This is Bear Fox back again to another brand new video today. I'm not recording any face cam, I'm just making this video pretty simple, sweet. So, as you guys can see, I have just re repainted my desktop, and I guess now it looks good. It was, you know, it was very clumsy over here, so I just, you know, clean everything and put that in my recycle bin. After this video, I'm just gonna control Z it up. But yeah, for making this video guys, today I've brought you guys an ultimate guide for drastically reducing pain in Fortnite. All you have to do is just follow every step in this video. I'm gonna just make it sweet and simple and short again. So yeah, as you guys know, my videos are so short. So yeah, let's move with the first step that you have to follow. Okay, so the first step is just go to your settings. And over here you have to go to internet settings and then just reset your internet what this will do is restart your computer with a fresh connection then you have to go and search for command prompt and type in ipconfig slash flush dns and ipconfig release and then you have to type in ipconfig slash renew and this will turn off and turn on your network now once done with that guys here comes the very most important and you know it's very crucial thing that you have to follow one wrong step and everything will go wrong what you have to do is just go to registry editor and for that you have to run and type in regedit hit ok and give the permissions now over here guys what you have to do is just go to your edge key local machine in there you have to go to software and over here you have to search for Microsoft and in Microsoft you have to go to Windows NT okay there is Windows NT you have to go to the current version and over here you have to go to multimedia so I'm just gonna be searching here is multimedia and in there you have the system profile so guys what you have to do is just go to network throttling and type in f f f f f f and f so you have to type seven times f and hit ok then you have to go for system responsiveness and type in zero and hit ok now once done with that guys you have to go in the system profile and in the tasks and over here you'll find games you have to go in there and go for gpu priority and put that on 8 and hit ok then go for priority and go for 6 and hit ok go for scheduling category and put that on high and sfio priority put that on high now once done with that guys what you have to do is just go all the way back to the um, local key you know system okay so i'm just gonna put everything off okay now you have to go to the system in edge key local machine you have to go to system and over here you have to go for the current control set and over here you have to go in the control and then you have to go to power okay so you have to go all the way down to the power and over here you have to go for power settings in there you it's it's now a difficult thing you have to go and search for a file that ends with two zeros at the end so here is the file which ends with two zeros you have to go in there and now you have to search for a file that ends with d1 okay so you have you have to search all the way down and you'll find a file that will end with d1 here is the one uh, so you have to go in there and you have to search for uh, the attributes okay so here is the attribute you have to set that on two and hit okay once you're done with the attribute you have to go all the way back into the um, system okay now what you have to do again you have to go into the system and into the current control set now over here you have to go to the control and over here you have to see the way to kill service this will be default at 5000 you have to go and add 2000 over here and hit ok again you have to go all the way back as we did before and now you have to go for edge key current user and over here you have to search for the control panel 
and in the control panel you have to go for desktop and in the desktop you have to search for so um, you have to search for the menu show display over here this one here you have to put that on zero and hit ok once you are done with all of these settings just you you should have a wide connection again for the better paying you must have a wide internet connection and you can run your fortnite so i'm just gonna go with the epic launch and i'm just gonna run fortnite now again guys uh, due to the coronavirus pandemic uh, my internet connection is not so good but again all these things that we have done will help us a lot while playing games so i hope this video helps you out guys make sure to do leave a like hit that subscribe button and um, i'll be making these videos in very short period of time again so yeah just consider hitting the subscribe button and turning on the post notification bell so as you guys can see on the speed test i'm getting 152 ping that is really high for the game but still guys i'm gonna get into the game and i will show you that i am getting less than 152 ping while i'm in the game yeah there might be some packet loss because middle eastern servers are currently lagging out and i don't know what the hell is wrong with them but again so i'm just gonna get quick into the creative mode and i'm gonna be showing you guys some little bit of the game with the ping that i'm getting okay Make sure to do leave a like, hit the subscribe button, and I'll be making a lot of these videos to have you guys again. So yeah, meet you guys in another video. To stay tuned, guys. Keep watching Bear Fox, and peace.